Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a channel art or logo or background, whichever one you really choose. Okay, so when you're in Photoshop, you can go File, New, any any size will really work depending what you want it for. Right, you want to go to the background, right click on it and click layer from background this just makes unlocks the background pretty much okay then um make the color black on it and then import the text um i'm using the batman forever font if you don't have it i'll put a link in the description so you can get it i think it's probably the best one to use then you just write whatever um, you're, you're going to want to really. I'm just going to put Jinx the clan I'm in. Okay. Position it right. Then after you've done that, you want to right click on the text layer. Um, yeah. Ooh, what the hell? Okay, finally. And then right click on the text layer and click Rasterize Text. This is very important that you do that. Okay. After that, you go to the um, polygon tool right there. If you hold down on it, you get these options. You want to go to the polygon lasso lasso tool like that. Okay. And then you just start cutting out little triangles and then cutting them out like that. Okay. Well, this takes a little while, so I'll start talking soon. In the meanwhile, just do this to each of your texts a few times. Right, see you soon. I don't know where you're going or when you're coming home. I left the keys and I'm trying, baby. Do you think I'd wanna go? And I'd like to be there with you, but you see, I'm on the road. Don't worry, I'm doing my thing, killing stages. I run this tour from the road to the show to the answer party. Well, when it's over, I'm done, I'm yours. I promise, girl, when I'm there, I swear I'm staying. We can do it five times a day. Yeah, they told me we're praying. But I had to call, cause I need to let you know. The tour ain't over, we had to add one more show. Well, I knew you'd say that. Yeah, baby, you ain't never gonna get this. I go from the bus to the stage, but you don't like me. This young and reckless, young and stupid, I get this. That's what it is when I'm on my grind. Where I spend my time, never looking for trouble. But it seems that it's all I find. You know that I get you. This is who I am. And I see you soon. I know you don't give a damn. Just know that I hate the fact that you're alone. That's why I'm gonna get my ass back on. Yeah. either but that's what makes it perfect because when we get wherever there is you know it'll be worth it i'm picturing bright sands everything lit up in neon okay right after you um well, wait what am i doing <laughs> after you've done that you this one's okay okay after you've done that you oh shit what am i doing Ah, uh, sorry. Right. Um, you wanna get this picture? No, nice. Ugh. It's a nice scratched picture. I'll just go find it and just drag it in, drop it like that. You wanna make the um this image bigger than the text so you can clearly see. 
one sec, I don't know what this is doing. Right, yeah. Big enough so you can actually see the scratches. And then, after you've done that, you go up here and you click the multiply to make that mode. As you can see, like that. I'm just going to change the black ground to a more black. Okay. Like that. There we go. Okay. Right, after you've done that, you want to click on the jink, the um, red layer, the text layer. Then go up to this and click magic wand. Hold shift. Well, yeah, you hold shift and just start clicking nearly all of the little cutout pieces. Um, don't really want that big piece in. Like that. After you've done that, you want to click Control J. Then you right you right click on it. Go to Blending Options, and you will want to put an outer glow on it. You want to put the color as the normal black. That and make the blend option normal. Like that. Okay. You want to turn up the opacity to full. Oh, leave that down. You want to put this spread up a bit and then put the size up I am going to put it um, probably up to that as you see what it looks like like that I'm going to put the probably add the spread up a bit ok and then I don't know you could add a drop shadow I'm guessing But I'm not going to because I just want to get this done. Okay. Then, oh shit. What did I do? Huh. So done. Okay. Then, after you do it, you've done that. Oh, what is it doing? Okay. After you've done that, you want to then go into back into your photos and then you want to get the smashed glass then oh, as you can see and then you just do drag that in as well you want to get it like the same size as the other one again and make sure um, the middle of it is in the middle of your text right then you go back up to the this part. Then you click screen and as you see it's there. And then you can just adjust it and all like that. Okay. Right. And then this is what you would end up with. Right. Thanks for watching. Um, please leave a like, comment on if you want me to do another tutorial or what do you want and subscribe. Right, see ya. Sometimes I rag like hoes, sometimes I real like pop, sometimes I focus on the flow to show the skills I got. Sometimes I focus on the dough to get these bills I got. This is a message for some rappers trying to steal my spot. You niggas famous on the internet, I'm